freaking joint. Welcome to Area Locked, a challenge series where I'm going to put my fishing skills to the test. The challenge is simple. I or you, the viewers, pick an area of the lake and I cannot leave or fish out of this area for the time of the challenge. Some challenges may have different rules than others that you, the viewer, can pick. So comment down below and the highest light comment may be the next challenge that I attempt. Now see, we all messed up is thinking that I wouldn't do these challenges. <laughs> so we just put in a camp bar stool right here. We've had a couple comments saying fish the mouth of the creek. Fish no live scope. Y'all see a live scope right here? So this is uh what they call beaver dam creek right here and we're allowed to fish around this point and all the way back to the second cut i'll pull up a map right now to show you what i can fish but we have to do this no electronics with a cane pole that i literally just bought i mean it is still in the package it cost me 8.99 at big man's and it's got some little minnow rig already on it uh if they break off we may have to strip line off one of my other rods but i haven't used a cane pole since man i caught a big old catfish when i was little out of a pond on a cane pole and that is literally the last time i remember ever using one all right we got her rigged up so four hours starts at 8 40. Let's go try to catch them. Got some. Oh, a little bad. <laughs> Got a little largey. <laughs> well, we ain't hit the right species yet, but I ain't gonna lie, this came for us kind of fun. Trying to fun indeed. Oh my god, it's a dang catfish. <laughs> Big old catfish too. <sighs> they ain't gonna break my rod. <laughs> I just bought it. Hope this is the entertainment y'all wanted. Oh, me. Come here, dude. There we go, bud. Get it. Eh? Nice size uh, channel on the game pole. <laughs> Took a lot more effort than I thought. <laughs> but I believe we'll be fine if we hook into a big one. Because this pole just whooped up fish's butt. 
Come on now, I'm just piddling around all these docks through here. You know, I'm trying to give the first hour to these docks around here. Now, these docks aren't very deep, so I really don't have a lot of high hopes, honestly, for them. But we're going to fish the next two docks, and then we're actually going to crank the engine and just go look around, see if we can find any laydowns, or we'll take the pole and jab it in the water and see if we can find something that's a little bit deeper or you know find a random brush pile and get hung on it but initially that's the plan we probably i don't know 30 minutes in so still got three and a half hours to figure something out freaking giant oh my god no freaking way no freaking way <laughs> so steven can't catch him with a cane pole in a minute huh that is a freaking toad freaking way oh that's every bit of 15 inches oh my god look at my hand compared to this fish y'all said it couldn't be done <laughs> so i was just going around these docks and this is the only dock that i can find that's in like 10 feet of water so it's like the deepest dock down this whole stretch. Man, he freaking smoked it. Gotta get us another minute down there. I say for some reason they got chicken wire all over the dock. You can't really fish it, but try this little hole back here. He smoked it. That is a nice fish. <laughs> I was not expecting that. I figured I'd get a little bluegill or something. Oh man. That makes me tickle to death. Oh, there's another one. There we go. <laughs> another 10 incher. Yeah, he's probably 11. Look at that one. No electronics, guys. Oh, Steven can't do it. He can't fish without. Nah, scoop. So number two. Definitely have to make 
every minnow count because I ain't got that many left. I don't know why I only bought two dozen. So we're fishing probably about five feet, I guess. Nothing super deep. Just putting it in this corner right here, letting it sit. I was running my mouth on that one a bit. He was gone with it. So I'm hoping we hit this dock at the right time and we're just able to complete this challenge. There's another one. Another nice one. Oh my God, another toad, man. Are you kidding me? Oh. <laughs> we might be able to get the 12 inches. Oh, another toad. <laughs> oh, let's get him off so I can get my minnow back in the water. So he don't die. He's still on the, the line. Oh my dude, are you kidding me? There he is. Giant. Ain't as big as some of the other ones, but <laughs> another 11, 12 inch. Ay, ay, ay. Just gotta thoroughly fish this dang dog. Test another one. On the cane pole. City up in here, boys. <laughs> On the cane pole. <laughs> Number six. Well, <clears throat> we got about 20 something more minutes. We need four more fish. But if y'all think that I'm ashamed of losing this challenge, oh, y'all got another thing coming because catching those big fish on this cane pole definitely one of the funnest things I've done in a while especially like the catfish and then the one that's probably about 15 inches <clears throat> just makes you feel good that you're able to dissect these dogs figure out a bite and then capitalize on it I mean I was expecting to catch keepers i was never expecting to catch the size that i have caught today so in my head i win the challenge but at the same time if i don't catch four more in like 20 to 30 minutes you guys win because you get a chance to win a hundred pack of jigs so if i do fail this challenge the way you enter is you like the video you share the video to like facebook or something and you be subscribed to the channel and comment down below. And that's how you get it entered for a chance to win. Now a week from the day that this video is posted is when I will be selecting a winner. So y'all stay tuned. I'm gonna try to get four more in the box, but it's not looking good. I, I believe the bite window is just already gone. But I'm gonna, I should be able to make one more round around this whole dock within 20, 30 minutes. So hopefully we can pick up one or two more. Is up. So we didn't get 10, but 
Lord have mercy, we got some good ones. Look at that fish. <laughs> so we got three, yep, six of them, over 10 inches with a cane pole, no electronics in an area that I don't fish. So comment down below to win your jigs, but I don't want to hear nothing else about you can't catch them without a live scope. 